up guys? How's it going? This is some guy. And today I'll be giving my opinion on Fredo's Daily Duffy. Uh, this came about a month ago. I am late, but I have very much avoided uh, looking, uh, uh, obviously listening to it and uh, watching any other reactors go. Basically any information about Daily Duffy I have avoided. So I don't know if it was well received, but I'm excited. Uh, his, his first Daily Duffy was... I mean, most things that Fredo does are fire, especially when he gets in his bag, you know, in terms of like wordplay, deep lyrics, like that's, that's, that's my favourite Fredo, even though he can do the, the, the less serious boss talk kind of songs. But anyway, uh, I'm intrigued, especially because it's nine minutes, I feel like it's going to be at least partially deep. So yeah, let's jump in. His first daily duppy is one of my favorite daily duppies, like of all of them, to be honest. Especially the second half when he starts talking about um, more political, uh, yeah, moral stuff. Like it's just so hard, so hard. Let's go. My story, okay. I know consistency is key, but it's hard to stay consistent when you're in the mix and consistently a G. I'm still dishing out the keys, so I'm sorry if you're missing. Oh man, it's gonna be hard not to make this a really long video. Love the linking already. Consistency key, but obviously he's like linking key to the drugs, kilos. I'll try and not pause for the more obvious ones that the also Daily Duffy obviously uh, helps you with interpreting the lyrics. But I'll try and point out like the ones I particularly like. So yeah, let's go back. When you're I know consistency is key, but it's hard to stay consistent when you're in the mix and consistently a G. I'm still dishing out them keys, so I'm sorry if you're missing me on beats. Wanna know why I'm missing? Listen to me, please. I walk around town with enough jewels to change a nigga's life, so I gotta keep a pack that will take a nigga's life and all them braces on my back. Police chases from a racist in the night. Now I'm with my niggas racing in the back. All I ever done was trap, then I changed it to the Mac. But this beef will never change, that's just engraved into my life. I lost some niggas that I love, their names engraved into my eyes, but wait. Caught some niggas sipping fast and made them pay the price when I was younger. Never thought I'd be debating on a price with my youngest. Ready to go take a nigga's life and when they take this nigga's life. No, I'm breaking them a slice. Turn your block more smoky than Jamaican niggas' nights. Are they racist fam? Trying to be funny or trying to relate to man? 60 year old businessman trying to fist bump me instead of come and shake my hand. Like I ain't the same as man. They judge me in the meetings before I even get to say my plan. This is what I love about Fredo, man. Like, he has interesting perspectives. Um, of things that I obviously like, well, I say obviously, I personally can't relate to, but I I like hearing. Like just then, he was he, he was caught going into the more, the fairly typical, almost flexing talk of you know a businessman now you know I've got money, but then he's just talking about how like established other businessmen who are older see him as a bit of a gimmick. You know they try and fist bump him. They think he's a rapper. He's young. He's a rapper. Um, when actually he's got money, he's 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 made his money from business, you know, legitimate or not. And as far as I know, he's he's now making a lot of legitimate money as well, like through uh, uh, kick game and other things. It's so interesting because it, yeah, obviously he doesn't look like the stereotype of a businessman. But that's only because we have stereotypes in our head already. Like why why shouldn't he be? I'd, I'd imagine Jay Z probably had the same similar experience when he went legit in the sense that um you know he, he made it through sort of uh illegal means rapping and then had to be taken seriously as a very very good businessman obviously he's proven to be so sorry that was a rant but yeah that was an interesting perspective from Fredo. Fam, trying to be funny or trying to relate to man. 60 year old businessman trying to fist bump me instead of coming like you wouldn't fist bump someone normally at work like that's weird so like it's it's almost mocking I, I, yeah, I, I, I find that perspective very interesting. Shake my hand like I ain't the same as man. They judge me in the meetings before I even get to say my plan. Plus, every time I hit the booth, my nigga needs a rental car. My nigga needs some money now. My nigga needs a brick or loose. My brother's on the road to jail and he needs a home as well. The man just lost their phone as well. That's another rack to Broski's girl. You know, the crew's fire. My six I lost could go and fucking start a huge fire. Trying to focus on business and move higher. Still got a trip and show them who's flyer. Stuck up on the road like a new tire. You yeah. liar. Meanwhile, them clowns still trying to speak on my name. But between 
between all them lames Them boys ain't never left nothing fast asleep in the rain We're really rapping about them shootings, find it cheeky and strange You can find me where the peace to be made Me and my BM started speaking again I know she shed a tear, when I had to leave it was pain But at least you get to weep in the rain Sometimes I don't see my daughter for couple she, so it was his baby mum was 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 crying, but at least it gets to cry in the Range Rover. Who was it that said, "Money doesn't buy happiness, but I'd rather be sad in a Lambo or something like that"? If yeah, if you, if you know, let me know. But yeah, it's 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 interesting because yeah, I guess if your choices are unhappy or unhappy, but in one you've got money, in one you don't. I guess you would pick money, right? Even though it doesn't buy you happiness. Yeah, that was funny. When I had to leave, it was pain. But at least you get to weep in the rain. Sometimes I don't see my daughter for a couple weeks and it's pain. But if I'm sitting there every day, my dreams slip away. Then I'll be broken. Mommy will be acting more funny than she's been when I'm paid. Cheat up. It's been a while since I've been to your grave. Because Billy and your brother died and it's increasing my pain. I feel them streets in my veins. Also, just to acknowledge how many times he referenced the word pain in different ways, then, you know, uh, in terms of, I think he references window pain. Pain is in like physical pain, but like you get flipping it and linking it back again, it was hard. I've been to your grave, cause Billy and your brother died, and it's increasing my pain. I feel them streets in my veins, the streets feel it the same. Mum had me at 18, and she was feeling to blame. And my mum feeling your pain, but my dad could have been there, or fed and fret, would have been just the same. For all I need is a chain, now all I need is a plane. Tell myself to a business, now it's easy to say. Right now, I'm legally and illegally paid, so I can mm. quit rap today. Look like I'm streaming away. So many holes that I pipe, I don't even know why. I and yeah, I'll try not to tangent too much here, but that's such an interesting place he's in now because he's saying that he could leave the the illegal life behind and he's making plenty of money. But how do you do that when your respect and your original fan base are all from that other side, you know? It must be so hard because if, if, if he just cut ties with it, kind of like how uh, what happened with NWA, you know, they got big by talking about the streets in Compton. They got money and they kind of, they moved out, or well, some of them did. It's it's tricky. It's tricky. Um, actually, I just want to just check something though. Into my eyes, but wait, caught some niggas slipping fast and made them pay the price when I was young. No, I, I was wondering then if he'd been going for the same rhyme the whole time. I don't think it's quite the whole time, but he's been going with this pain. Uh, what, what else he said? And illegally paid, so I could quit rap today. Look like I'm streaming away. So oh, wait, that that's that same rhyme he's been carrying on for ages. Any holes that I pipe, I don't even know why I like. I just know they don't love me. I need to hold me a wife so I can settle down and focus in life. Or I'm gonna die alone in this life with just a whole load of eyes. Still the scariest time. It's going home in the night. Again, like I love how he kind of like takes a, a flex, which is like essentially I've got so much money and ice. He's talking about how he's lonely. He can't has to find a wife, but you know, worst case scenario, he's gonna what was it die alone with all this ice on? So it's it's kind of like letting it, you into his worries or like what he's not happy about, but also flexing at the same time. It's not the way he, not the way he writes. Die alone in this life with just a whole load of ice. Still the scariest time. It's going home in the night. I gotta keep my eyes so open and wide, just in case they get the low on my home. And I didn't know, and they tried. That's how we got the low on your bro. He had to go to the sky every day. Mm. This is really how it goes to survive. How it goes in this life. How I'm grown, and I still gotta go with my knife. Even when I fucking go to the bar, I only get peace when I'm closing my eyes. I used to only wow. wear designer. Now I'm heavy on design. Now when they're asking what my track is, I'm telling them it's Mine. I didn't buy it in no shop. Wow. Actually, I get it from my mind. Wait, what a flex! I'm not, I don't think I've heard that before. Like, oh yeah, what, you know, where's your tracky from? Oh, it's mine. What a flex! Like, it's not even like this a fancy designer label. It's he's 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 done it himself. Damn. Now when they're asking what my track is, I'm telling them it's mine. I didn't buy it in no shop. My G, I get it from my mind. I used to sell my mm. stock in trap houses. Now I'm selling it online. Mm. You can ask about me in Dubai. I'm quite a naughty dude. It don't matter what you're oh, in. Oh man. Daily W video editors always manage to like raise the level again, like just just for that one. Bar. No, I'm selling it online, and you can ask about me in Dubai. I'm quite a naughty dude. And yeah, he's like, I, I make it myself, and then like, obviously, it's him animated. No matter what year it is, because every year I pull up to them clubs and I bring them back to 1942. And every girl in my section, they get in quite a naughty mood. I got some OGs bold that got thrown in a slammer, but that's how it can go when you've been holding a hammer. Three arms, mm. last time he was on. Obviously, talk about his bros getting thrown in the slammer. That's how it goes when you're holding a hammer. Really nice double bat. Obviously, he's talking about his, them holding 
guns, hammers, but also how do you get sent to the slammer prison? The judge's hammer coming down, that was hard. Then a slammer, but that's how it can go when you've been holding a hammer. Three unks, last time he was on road, man, they didn't have no phones with a camera. Picture wow. that, I can't stand that. Meanwhile, the this is what I mean, like. He could have just said like, "Oh yeah, you know, free my uncle. He's been he's been locked for time or something." Obviously, I'm not a rapper, <laughs> but you know what I mean. Like something more you've heard before. But instead, he's like, he's he he hasn't been on road since they didn't have like camera phones. Um, picture that. Like it's just so clever the way he writes. He was on road, man. They didn't have no phones with a camera. Picture that. I can't stand that. Meanwhile, the feds still trying to take me to prison for the way that I'm living. They're trying to blame me for killings. Go to kick game with warnings. Try staying in my image. First it was my mum's house. Now they invading my business. While I'm still getting chased by these dirty little girls that never had a job but think they're worth working in Chanel's. And little dots hit me. Said the fans working in his jail. And if I DM him, he's used to bring... Who was that? A little dot? Working in Chanel's. And little dots hit me. Who is that? Let me know. Let me know who that is. I don't know if I recognise him, but I'm. By these dirty little girls that never had a job but think they're worth working in Chanel's. And little dots hit me. Said the fans working in his jail. And if I DM him, he's used to bring some sir in the cell, yo. I sent so much was worthy for hell, but I kept faith in God. Kept working and prevailed. My nigga tried to hide the hate, but once I couldn't hide the cake, it wasn't working. I could tell that shit was hurting me as well. I ain't got no game. It's my chain that does the flirting with the girls, and I don't dance, but I got cocaine that's twerking. Again, like, I ain't got no game, it's my chain that's a flirt with the girls. It's like, it's kind of like self insulting, but also a flex at the same time. It's like, I, you know, I can't chat to girls, but I've got uh, a fancy enough chain, I don't even need to talk to them anyway. Well, I ain't got no game, it's my chain that does the flirting with the girls. And I don't dance, but I got cocaine that's twerking on the scales. Everybody got a story, I just laid it more real. My story was a sad one, but I changed it for real. My story started in a small house, it's changing four deals. Now the penthouse got three stories, like chasing both films from all the pain I ordeal. Only way to ease this pain is by making more meals and taking more souls. I'm booking visits for show, like I'm booking visits for blacks. I'm booking visits for LD, I'm booking visits for Babs. I'm having meetings with designers, having meetings with stylists. Send I'm sending money to VD, I'm sending money to tricks. Since I go with kick game, everyone I know wants a couple of kicks. My jail niggas need one for their chick, and then some more for their kids. So many real niggas that come on the list. How could I say no to my brothers when none of them switch? Meanwhile, I've been working on a couple of hits. No music, laid something down, we got another one mixed. And I got 10 gyps to find out where another one lives. Oh man, I'm trying to let him ride, but so many little links here. I'm sure you could, you picked them out as well, but yeah, the. The, the hits like talking about like making musical hits mixing like musical mixing but obviously there's the double entendre there of like killing mixing drug mixing like it's just constant constant clever wordplay say no to my brothers when none of them switch meanwhile i've been working on a couple of hits no music laid something down we got another one mixed and i got 10 gyps to find out where another one lives and then we're coming equipped but we ain't burgling this one in your wig gobby's mom turning to 38 his mom was a snitch damn my little nigga was the son of a bitch my credit was so good right. yeah his mom was and we're coming to quit, but we ain't burgling this one in your wig. Gobby's mom turning to 38, his mom was a snitch. Damn, my little nigga was the son of a bitch. My credit was so good, and that's because I come from the strip. So before I ever bought a house, I... My credit was so good, and that's because I come from the strip. Again, like the credit card strip. Son of a bitch, my credit was so good, and that's because I come from the strip. So before I ever bought a house, I put one on the wrist. I know them streets need Fred's heat back. It's like a battle on myself, it really gets me mad. Cause if I focus on rap, I'll be a deadbeat dad. But if I focus on being a dad, I'll lose the bread we had. And if I don't play my role in the block, then they'll say I'm acting different. But if I go back too much, then I'll go back to prison. My life. Exactly, that's what I was trying to say earlier. Like, if he, if, if he, if he fully steps away from the road, then. Wait, it's, it's, he said it obviously better. If he plays a role in the block, the block then they'll say I'm acting different. Then they're acting, they, they, yeah, they'll question his authenticity. But if he doesn't, if he's fully authentic still, he'll end up in prison probably. But if I go back too much, then I'll go back to prison. Yeah. My life's full of bad bitches and bad decisions. Rap don't last forever. Now I'm trying to handle business. Because mm. I don't focus on these businesses. Then when this rap finishes, I'll be on them interviews. Talking about some flowers that I'm old. Like allow mm. it, bro, you're old. Real hustlers take all their fucking flowers as they grow. I'm the type to make some flowers from the snow. Spending hours at the stove. Now they give me 60,000 for a show. I spend an hour, then I go. I spend an hour with a hoe. I spend a thousand like a joke. You niggas sounding like a bro. How can I be a good rapper? Good dad, good businessman, a good boss, a nice boyfriend, a good trapper. I can do it all, even if I had some powers and a cape. Now they 
just ain't enough hours in a day. I got the game power, but they said that it takes Yeah, not enough hours in a day, and a lot of those things uh, are at odds with each other, you know. If you're going to be a good or like authentic street rapper, like how could you be a responsible father at the same time? Like, and you could try your best, and I'm sure plenty of people do, you know, it's not, I'm not criticizing, but it, you can't be the best at all of those things at once because they, there's conflict there. Wow. Some powers in a cape, now they just ain't enough hours in a day I got the game power, but they said that it takes hours on the train I didn't know no one, so I would go shower with my blade Now I'm a first class Emirates customer You boys ain't never showered on a plane Hours in a day, I got the game power, but they said that it takes hours on the train I didn't know no one, so I would go shower with my blade Now I'm a first class Emirates customer You boys ain't never showered on a plane I got a mountain full of cane my so he's saying he didn't know anyone. I'm assuming he's talking about prison. Like he said, he went to sh the showers with a blade. I'm assuming to like make a name for himself. And now he's like, now I'm showering on private planes. I mean, I don't know anything like either of those extremes. But so to move between them must be. Damn. My first class Emirates customer You boys ain't never showered on a plane I got a mountain full of cane My life's gotten hard Now not to be sounding like I'm vain When the price of a Lamborghini car Sounding like a chain Me and nobody in London It's sounding like the same I never jumped on no one's way Fam, they found me in my lane Now niggas mad at me, they're broke Fam, that's sounding like the plane Now you're sounding like a lame No one never gave me nothing Fam, I found it on the train Yeah, he thought that he was gutter So they found him by the drain Surrounded by the grain You know, they found it in his brain And bullets in his chest The streets know we Pass. Every time we're putting to the test, don't invest in no guns, go and put it in a vest, snatch a body from his breath, now we're looking for the next, since 2020 and West, we put it in a best, three bodies, now we're up to like 6 a.m., but we ain't looking for a rest, catch him slipping when he's looking for his breath. So many bars, I can't pick them all out, This he's going off, and also two thirds of the way through, same beat, and I'm not bored of it, there's no hook. Now we're up to like 6 a.m. But we ain't looking for a rest. Catch him slipping when he's looking for. So I think about that 2 a.m. Was it 2 a.m. three bodies? Bodies. Now we're up to looking for the next. Since 2020 and West, we put it in the best. Three bodies. Now we're up to like 6 a.m. But we ain't looking for a rest. Catch him slipping when he's looking for his breakfast. I had half a million in change when she slipped up. But I was drunk, so I took him for his necklace. I shot him, but I'm reckless. She said that she likes me while she's staring and looking at my necklace. This dumb little lady don't even know she's looking at his death wish. Because someone's going to die wow. if they tried to take these. And someone had to die before I could even make these. See, he kind of links back to what he said earlier about like he doesn't even need to speak to girls. His chain is a talking, so he's talking it later on about how he's got a girl looking at the chain, and she's kind of like infatuated with it. It sounds like, and now he's flipping it like, oh, she doesn't even know she's looking at a death wish because if someone took this, you know, you anyone, you know, that's what's going to happen to you. It's Cause someone's gonna die If they tried to take these And someone had to die Before I could even make these That's the realest shit you ever hear That man had to shed a tear All the issues that I go through Make it hard on Fred's career And die my nigga woo I still can't believe it's true I still can't believe it's you First Billy then you Real talk I can't believe it's two Still it only took a week or two Pop out like peekaboo Leave a nigga sleeping too So man I'm wow. speaking to man I don't know who he's talking about But obviously it sounds like Someone One of his One of his uh uh rose was killed and he's like again implicit he's like only took a week or two some like peekaboo like is it implying that whoever did it has been dealt with should we say but in such a yeah indirect way a week or two pop out like peekaboo leave a nigga sleeping too so mind out who you're speaking to mind out where you're sleeping to how my shoe is creeping through and leaving through last three patterns no one didn't even get nicked we didn't leave a clue this year i might grab the rose like i need a poo pull up with a star and i got stars in the ceiling too 7k a month on the rent you should see the view i wish billy could see it too funny sometimes i don't know where this life is leading to really fam i need a clue i mean 7k a month is ridiculous but uh it is probably bad. I'm actually surprised that for a penthouse in London, it's not more than that, <laughs> just because it's London. Um, but that's still a ridiculous amount of money. That's crazy. Wish Billy could see it too. Funny sometimes, I don't know where this life is leading to. Really, fam, I need a clue. For all I know, them streets are a myth. The realest niggas get burdened. They find God, then preach to the kids about this life isn't worth it. All them years in jail must make them guys forget how hard it gets when life isn't working. No sex, be a dreaming to get inside of a German. Went to jail for a stabbing. Came home and done another one like my knife wasn't learning. Now you can get a nine for. It's how he puts stuff, like. I was put in jail for stabbing. 
was it came and did another one like my knife wasn't learning like it's almost like it's such an interesting way of putting it like he couldn't learn like he, it's, it's impossible for him to learn so like the only thing that could learn is his knife and you know how could that Went to jail for a stabbing Came home and done another one Like my knife wasn't learning Now you can get a nine for seven grand Like it's a Birkin I'm grinding for certain So my time The sad put his knife in a person Thought my guy was a surgeon Before Cat and Bambi All my likers were twerking I've been overlapping niggas When it comes to rapping and trapping Like the mic was a circuit Now the game's full of fucking clowns Like it's a circus It usually takes holes Two years to get tired of me Getting all inside overlapping niggas when it comes to rapping and trapping like the mic was a circuit now the game's full of fucking clowns like it's a circus it usually takes holes two years to get tired of me getting all inside of the service till they realize there's more to life like holidays and nice little purses that i ain't gonna purchase even though she knows i'm nice off these verses and my ring and watch is 300 like little dirkers i make shit go happen in the flats you know what happens with them straps while you've been capping in your raps if you ain't with this pattern, then move out of the way When my niggas get it cracking, yours are out here to play They get one chance like mine's filled 2008 and 2012 my phone was on 2000 a day Take my nigga Wait, what? Pattern, then move out of the way When my niggas get it cracking, yours are out here to play They get one chance like mine's filled 2008 and 2012 my phone was on 2000 a day Take my niggas out to eat, that's 2,000 a steak Tell them boys trying to keep up, they're 200,000 and late Everybody's a shooter, welcome to 2,000 and fake Two nights, no cap, 60,000 in tape Ask my nigga Zeus, straight cash, living proof Nigga what, nigga when, nigga who, tell me who you did it to You know what me and my niggas really do For my nigga Woo, get on your door like it's delivery Woo, all that boy we did it to Them niggas must be dumb, I got a couple businesses But still my business isn't done That means I'm coming for you niggas, and I'm coming for riches Let me welcome you to this this is unfinished business. Wow. I don't know what to say. Um, I think from a technical standpoint, he might have actually topped his first one. To do nine minutes on the same beat and to keep me fully like gripped the whole time is crazy. I think the second half of his first one still like has got me harder than pretty much any day that I've ever just because of, of what he was saying. But like that's for like maybe a two or three minutes didn't. Uh, as an overall thing, I think he might have topped himself. Let me know if you agree or disagree. Um, but either way, yeah, Fredo keeps keeps improving in my opinion. Um, he can kind of do it all really he, he's been releasing tracks recently that are more uh you know less intense more like um flex kind of the kind of songs you can kind of put on and just sit back and not like deep too much but he can do this as well he does it so well and i just love how he writes he, he's so clever with his pen um yeah flow ways is it to be fair, yeah, I haven't really thought about it before. Flow wise, he, he isn't he doesn't really vary that much, but I think that works for him. And I think that adds to the emphasis. I, I kinda like that. Um I could also be wrong, it might be because I'm so into his lyrics that I'm not deeping when he's switching his flow up. Either way, he's one of the best UK has got, in my opinion. Um yeah, fire. Uh, that's all I've got to say. Let me know what you thought. If anyone's got any <clears throat> Tracks or freestyles of Fredo's that I may not have heard or done on the channel before, let me know. Um, yeah, and yeah, let me know what you thought. Like, comment if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. We'd really appreciate that. Otherwise, I'm out.